Good morning, Grovers. Morning, Grovers. We have a special day planned for you today. Um, we've been talking a little bit about prayer and um, just like this idea that we really haven't like prayed over your prayers as a school for a while. Yeah, if you have been walking down the hallway like from Benton to Shields, you'll notice that last year we set aside a specific case for prayers. Yeah. And this year we haven't done an activity like this. Um, so it's about time that we update some of our prayers. Um, yes. So what we would like to do today is give you a time and a space um, to, to identify some of the things that are, are most important on your, on your heart, I guess. Um, things that, that you want to be praying for. Um, so we're going to do this a little bit different than we have in the past couple of prayer chapels that you might remember. Um, we want to specifically give you a chance to pray over it yourself. Um, and so we're going to um, first give you a little bit of time um, to write down a prayer. Um, Does it have to be like a like fancy written down prayer? Um, no, honestly, it can even, like you don't even have to write out an entire prayer. You can just literally write what it is you want to be praying for. Super. Like if, or you can write out your whole prayer too, I suppose. If I want to uh, pray for um, my dad, I could even just write my dad. If there's something specific that I want to write, I can. But let's also say this. Um, whatever you write, um, write it in a way that you're okay with people seeing it because yeah. we're going to be posting it on, on the wall um, right by Heckner Chapel. Yeah, if you really want to pour your heart out in your prayer, by all means, go for it. Um, just probably don't write your name unless you want people to like really be praying specifically for you, then that's okay too. Yeah. So um, we're going to give you a little chunk of time to first write something on, on this piece of paper. And number two, um, to spend a little time in prayer yourself and then we'll close out the time together. We'll pray for you at the end. Can I say one thing before we yeah. move into that time? I think, too, sometimes we think that our prayers sometimes are too little for mm. God to listen to or, or maybe even too big for him to answer. And so I just want to encourage you um, to remember that, um, that we're told in Scripture that we don't need to be anxious about anything. Um, but in everything... We can bring everything to God. In prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, we can present our requests to God. So in other words, we can give anything to God, yeah. no matter how big or how small. And so I would encourage you just to like really um, be honest. Be honest with God and be honest with yourself about what are those things that you need prayer for right now. Cool. So uh, we're going to give you a moment now to write down something and to pray over it yourself. God, I don't know um, all the things that are on the hearts of our Grovers, um, but Lord, you know. And each one of these prayers, they matter to you. And so God, um, I pray that as we lift up these prayers, Lord, that we would hear, we would hear from you. God, um, maybe it's just in a gentle peace that, that comes over us. Um, maybe it's just an obvious answer to prayer, um, but God, that we would know that you are present, um, even in the small things. 
but especially to Lord in the big things. Um, Lord, just speak to our hearts and minds and help us to know, God, that you're here with us and listening to us. Jesus, we love you so much, and we are just so thankful again just for all you've done for us, and especially in this Lenten season. We thank you for your sacrifice on the cross. We pray these things in your strong and powerful name. Amen. Amen. All righty, Grovers, uh, if you want to give those pieces of paper to your teacher, and teachers, if you would get those in our mailbox at some point, that would be great. We'll get them posted for you, and we'll be praying over them too. We'll see you guys later. Bye, guys. Bye.